Well, good morning. It's uh, what is it, Saturday, June 11th. I'm trying to lay at the barn foundation here. I'm trying to keep this as our constant corner. Spent a few nights on it already. It is uh, 9.20 in the morning right now. I've been working on it since about 7 by myself. Hasn't been going the greatest. So, uh, fire-in-law is coming over here in another hour or so. Hopefully we can get it figured out. Can't figure out why. We're always like two to three inches off. So I'm not sure why I can't get it square, but it's been a lot longer process than I was expecting. Although the YouTube videos make it seem super simple, but uh, hasn't hasn't been the case for us. Here's another update. So it's uh, 12.30, I'm getting ready to break for lunch. So you can see behind me, got some red paint right there. Finally got the barn squared up, throwing some paint on the ground where we need to put the auger. Got all these laid out on uh, both of the 60 foot sides. And we're gonna have lunch, figure out what we need to do for our end walls. We got a couple sliding doors going in there, so take lunch, figure out what we need to do for those, and then we'll punch some, some holes this afternoon, hopefully. It is 4.30 in the afternoon, we finally got some holes dug. My buddy Mark came over, got us started with the auger, trying to put some sauna tubes in, gonna start getting those lined up and getting ready for concrete here in a few days. Good morning, it's Sunday the 12th, 7 o'clock in the morning, been digging here for a little bit. This is our first hole, and uh, we learned a lot yesterday with digging with that three-point auger to have that thing perfect in line where it needs to be. We we're thinking it uh, kind of seemed to want to walk on us a little bit, so that's why we have this giant hole, and the actual hole that needs to be dug is over in this area. But, so we got six of them set yesterday. Of course it rained on us and this cardboard doesn't seem the highest quality so we put some plastic over it. And uh, see, the father-in-law John helped me all day on that stuff. We'll see about hopefully drilling some more holes this afternoon. Get some more of these tubes put in the ground. Alrighty, so it's uh, Sunday, June 13th, June 12th. Uh, out here digging today by myself. Just got 11, yeah, 11 holes dug. That's pretty much all our per perimeter. Um, that south side, the west side of the barn, and then the north side. Still have to do the east side yet, but I'm gonna do those last. And uh, went a lot better today, a lot faster. Kind of know what to expect and uh, a lot, I don't know. We learned a lot yesterday, so um, it's coming handy today when we're digging, or I guess I'm digging today by myself. Um, got a couple more tubes to set. Hopefully today I'm gonna try to see if I can not get them in there by myself. It's nice to have a couple set of hands extra hands to hold the tube, get things level, but we'll see what I can do by myself today. And the kids have a dance recital tonight, so see if I can get a couple set before we have to go to dance. Wife Danae is helping me tonight. Put the kids to bed, it's nine o'clock. We're just cleaning out some of these holes. Just trying to get them a little bit more lined up with straight and uh, Get them a little bit deeper so I have less hand dig. Morning, it's Monday, June 13th, a little after nine o'clock. Um, out here working by myself for right now. My wife today is gonna be helping me in a little bit. She had to take our daughter to the doctor for a checkup. But uh, things are going better. pretty good this morning. I got our west wall, all the col columns put in. So that's six of them got in this morning and it took about two hours so 
moving along a lot better than we have in the past. So, as soon as my wife gets here, we're gonna drill out some more holes and get them straightened up and uh, start putting more tubes in the ground. Hopefully, concrete is scheduled for Thursday. We've got a couple days to go and quite a few more holes to dig. Came in at me, <laughs> hoping it didn't affect your tube. <laughs> but Clyde here. You got a little twist out. Yep. Just kind of lay it down, kind of snug it up. Get the, yeah, just lay it down over there. Right? Turn it up. Feed the alarm. Now zoom down slow. Go forward. Now. Go ahead, keep holding it down or just. No, don't. Just Look put it a little forward. bit. Go forward a little bit. Now, yeah, do not push it It's Monday, June 13th, about 9 o'clock in the evening. Got pretty much all the holes punched. I need to punch uh, four more, I believe. Got one here, another one for a doorway. Same thing there, another one here. And finish out that line. Had a few different helpers today. Danae helped out for quite a while. Then uh, father-in-law John came over for an hour or two. <clears throat> then my brother Mark came over. I had to punch all these holes out. There's a bunch of them here because we are putting stalls on this side of the barn. So about every four foot here, that's for the stall door post. And then the stall will be 10 foot by 10 foot. I'm gonna hit it hard tomorrow morning. It's supposed to be cool tonight. So hopefully get a lot of these put in. Hopefully all of them tomorrow is the goal. Just got all the concrete poured. Put a little extra pad out here, some of the extra concrete. And they had screeching some of the tubes off. Concrete truck's leaving. We ended up crushing one of the tubes over there, so I guess we meaning him. 
So we got some extra concrete in the wheelbarrows and in the bucket of the tractor. Now the fun begins. It only took them less than an hour to pour all the stuff. We had a pretty eventful morning this morning. It's one o'clock now, uh, the 16th. Got all the concrete in, got a little extra pad poured and uh, whooped. We are whooped. Truck got here at 10. We just finished up getting everything cleaned up and uh, it's now put away, but all the concrete's cleaned up and we got our other little pad cleaned up as well. This is the completion of all the foundation work that needs to be done. Next video, we'll be starting to build the barn.